Temple University was the first school in the country to adopt an owl as its mascot nearly 130 years ago. And now the current Parliament of Owls has adopted another to take part in game day festivities at Lincoln Financial Field. Meet Stella. She's a three and a half year old great horned owl who now has a new place to hang out on Saturdays in the fall. But before she took to the sidelines, she got a chance to make a first impression at Edberg Olson Hall before Coach Rule and hundreds of season ticket holders. Looks like she's ready to kill me. And bring her, bring your arm in a little bit more. Can we change it? There, it's perfect. Oh. Goodness. When she's not at the link, you'll find Stella here at Elmwood Park Zoo in Norristown under the watchful eye of people like education manager Sam Navarino, who is excited to help facilitate a relationship with Temple University. So how it came to be is that a Temple is looking to make themselves bigger and more well known and having a live mascot and not a lot of places have that. We were receptive to it because we knew Stella had the personality for it. Some of our other birds would not be able to handle the commotion of the football, such as our red-tailed hawk. So if Temple were the hawks, uh, this, this might not have happened. But Stella is so people-oriented and so visually motivated and stimulated that she's just perfect for it. Great horned owls are some of the most adaptable birds in North America and can adjust to a variety of climates and habitats both of which make having a live owl at a football game a little less far-fetched. So Stella is a three and a half year old gray horned owl and they can live to be about 30 years old. So she is very young for her age. They are nocturnal, so they wanna be able to see at night. And because their eyes are so big and powerful, they actually are fixed inside their skull. So if we hold our head still, we can move our eyes all around. But Stella can't do that. So in turn, she can actually move her head almost all the way around. Owls may be nocturnal, but Stella doesn't mind an early kickoff or two. And in Temple's first home game of the season, she quickly became one of the biggest stars of the show. As soon as we walked in, everybody was chanting for Stella. It was really incredible to see how well received and well known she is already. And she, that was her first game. It's not like she's been going there forever. That was her very first game. And everyone knew who she was. It was really amazing. But if you're wondering what will become of longtime mascot Hooter, don't worry. He's not going anywhere. In fact, you may just see the two together at a temple function very soon. <laughs>